Greetings, fellow Portal Masters. Greetings, fellow Portal Masters. I'm Crash Rouser, and it's once again time to crash the Skylands with another episode of the Honesty I've Hour here on the channel. Happy New Year to everybody out there. Yeah, that's right. Even though I filmed this in December, my time, you don't even know that. Why did I reveal that then? Regardless, Happy New Year to everyone out there, and I'm excited to bring you another episode of the Honesty Half Hour here on the channel, unsponsored edition. We're back to normal, baby. It's not retry. It's not that. We are back to our normal setting. There's going to be no more special episodes now for a little while. Maybe. We'll find out. But for now, I'm excited to bring you some more half hour episodes of Honesty. So ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be a normal episode. Now the biggest thing you may notice is there might be some inconsistencies with the after part where I'm filming the actual gameplay. Um, I will let you know that I'm doing all my intros now and at a later date I'll be recording the actual episode itself. So if I look different or I have a different shirt, it's not my Bob's Burgers shirt, then you'll know that that's why. But don't worry, the episodes are still going to look exactly the same. It's just going to have a little bit of inconsistency with what I'm wearing. So, apologies for that. But ladies and gentlemen, I'm very excited to bring more Honesty Half Hours. We're at episode 118, if I'm not mistaken. Episode 118. <laughs> so thank you so much for coming back to another episode of this Honesty Half Hour. If you don't know what the Honesty Half Hour is, well, first of all, I'm taking every single Skylander ever. Besides so a series 2, 3, 4 minis and variants. And what I'm doing is I'm putting them on the portal giving about 20 minutes of gameplay, 5 minutes dedicated to an intro, 5 minutes to an outro, and playing with them in the Destiny game they came from, and at the end doing all their moves and doing everything I can to give them the best judgment possible, giving them the definitive rating of 1 to 5, 1 being the worst, 5 being the best. Now, the last few episodes were the retry episodes, where I took Skylanders that I had before, gave them a second chance, and you know, they ended up with some pretty good episodes in the long run. Yeah, I think I did pretty well with it. And big thanks to our sponsor at the time. Unfortunately, I've dropped out of that sponsorship at this moment, so for now, it's just going to be normal on his half-hour episodes. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're wondering, Sky uh, Crash, I know the Skyland you have, and that's why I picked this video, but here's the biggest thing. How do I pick them? Well, first of all, if you don't know, every Skyland that has an episode yet are put away in these tubs. And all the scouts in that tub that haven't had an episode yet are put into a random name picker. So I click pick a random name, whatever Skylar comes up, that's the Skylar I'm delegating the half hour to. Again, roughly 20 minutes of gameplay, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less. And then after it's over, they get retired on the shelf behind me with all the other Skylanders. It's exciting. We are back to our normal episodes here on 118. I'm very excited to get into it through in, into this. So let's get started by clicking a random name right now. So here's your fun fact of the video. I think this year might be the last year of the Honesty Half Hour, if I do every episode properly, if I actually upload them on time. No, I mean they won't. But there's also only a few superchargers and a few giants left, and we're almost done. Like, there's the giants right there. There's four of them. And for superchargers, it's these three right here. So we're almost completely done a game. Today we have. Ooh. So the core lock is probably coming to an end soon, so Popthorn was in that core lock. Now, I did give him a fair try in the core lock. He was in a nice few episodes. But, again, he was in a few episodes. It doesn't have his own dedicated episode. So that's what's going to happen today for 118. So we're going to put Popthorn on the portal and get this started. All right, ladies and gentlemen, 20 minutes are on the clock. Popthorn is up. Popthorn needs no introduction. We just had the core lock on the channel, or we still have it. One of them. It's close to being ending, if I'm not mistaken. I think. Depending. Ooh, maybe I'll kill all my Skylanders super easy. We'll find out. Regardless, Popthorn is up. We have played with Popthorn numerous times here on the channel. I know that. He was entry number 30 in the inaugural Skylander Royal Rumble. Think about it after a minute as my dog. I want to take ownership. Yep. Upgrades. We have all of his upgrades. My dog is having a snack in the background. So you press square to puff in, and then you press square to do homing spikes. Press circle to pop, and you can also hold that there to shoot him. I absolutely love those. You can press. Oh. Where's square? Oh, yeah. If you're already you press that to just do the same thing. Pump ball pound is when you're in puff, you do triangle down. That one, you do more spikes. Um, you can leave a spot mine. And roll forward. There's a bunch of things, you know. Basically, whatever position he's in, as you can see, if he is in this one, you hold down circle, does that move. Press triangle, I poop. He poop things. 
and enemies can walk into it. When he's puffed up, that's when all the big things happen. You can see I use the homing missiles, one of the best things. You can actually hold down square and do more homing missiles. Maybe no, you can't. Try to press square. Press circle to unpuff and you actually do a little bit of damage. And press triangle to bam, go bam. And then you hold down triangle and you roll a little bit first and then you go bam. So he has two very unique movesets for sure. I think today we're going to do some time attack challenges. I'm going to try to rush through the levels as fast as I can. We got a collection here. Hold on. What am I miss? What I got in the collection? Does it say when I'm missing things? New Skylander, guys. Even though he was already here to begin with. Do I have any bot? Hold on. Hey, Tuck. Back, I gotta go buy things. Hold on. Yeah, I will. We still. Oh, we don't have a hat. Oh, I got a portal master rank up. I gotta rank up before I get all those. What level am I, anyways? 53! Okay. What am I missing for the collection? I already got all those. I don't remember doing that. Isn't that crazy? I don't remember doing that. I gotta get rid of that excavation mark, guys. Sorry. Oh, I think I just got rid of it. Nope. Hats? It's in hats, isn't it? Where's the hats? There's so many hats. Why is there so many hats? Do people even use hats? Still there. Legendary treasure? Oh, yeah, there it is. Snowball. I think that might be it. Yes, good. Thank God. All right, time attack. Let's do the level he came with, which was the Tower of Time, right? Wait, which level did he come with? Okay, Google. Okay, Google. What level did Pop Thorn in Skylanders come with? doesn't say what did he come with single character what single character oh he's only 15 bucks on Amazon what did he, what did he come with though why didn't it tell me what he comes with I forget which level he comes with guys I'm sorry he re let's just go to eBay let's see if I can find them tower time tower time sheepwreck was with um with with the other one you get that later okay there's another treat for her but she's gonna get that in the next filming but she's gotta be good she's gotta lie down put your head down it's okay you'll get it after i promise we have 16 minutes on the clock waste a lot of time then doing literally nothing it was four minutes of me just trying to figure out what level he's in i love this level this is actually one of my favorite levels for sure can i beat this level in under 20 minutes Someone beat it in 16. Whoever that is, my subscribers. Didn't I? Didn't I do this level as a time attack in one of the last episodes I did with Grim Creeper? I think I did, if I'm not mistaken. Go, 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 go. Here we go. Get him, get him, get him. Homing attack, homing attack, homing attack. Let's go. Come on, come on, Pop Thor, baby. Let's get him, 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 let's get him. Yes! Got it so far. How are you talking? You're frozen. Let's go, come on, come on, come on. Oh, this way. We're gonna speed run it, and we're gonna try to use as many as moves as he can, too, I promise. Now, if I mistakenly keep forgetting to use this hop, drop, and roll move, or whatever the kids are calling it these days. Just remember that I forgot about it. I know how this you. I know how this works. Please shut your mouth. I know how this works. Please shut your mouth. He says. Ugh. Here we go. Pointing the way. Get it. There's a tech element spot over there, but that's fine. Easy. Look at that. Nailing it so far. Okay, I'm going to try to beat these next guys with just that Grand Slam move. Did I do Grand Slam? No, I'm going to beat just these guys with just where I poop uh, bombs. Come on. Poop bombs, poop bombs, poop bombs. 
Poop bombs. Poop bombs. Poop bombs. Poop bombs. <laughs> poop bombs. Poop bombs. Poop bombs. Okay, the poop bombs doesn't really do much, let's be honest here. Puffing up! Yeah! 86 to 55 damage! Holy crud! Oh my gosh, wait, the rollback actually knocks them back so you can hit them twice. That's sick. Okay, we're not doing that though. Bam, 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 bam. Look at the homing missiles. This is why he was in the inaugural Skylander Royal Rumble, baby. He didn't win it and he got eliminated right away. Well, not too, too right away. It was kind of good. What I've noticed in any Skylander Royal Rumble, the first battle is usually the best one. Have you guys noticed that in the Skyliner Royal Rumbles? My dog has. Nope, oh, don't know why I was going over there. A present! Let's open it. I didn't need to, as I just realized. I don't think I needed to, did I? Oh, I got some time stop, though! 22 seconds of time stop? Let's go! That's the issue. See, like, it's gonna take me... This hour is 22 minutes to actually get it actually beat the level it's gonna take me longer than the 20 minutes of gameplay i normally do but i gotta do the level he came with because this is like everyone's introduction to pop was literally from this level because you probably played this level with pop because it was like oh i was supposed to do this level with pop you know let's go real fast come on pop buddy you can do it let's go all right part one done in only three minutes not too shabby, ladies and gentlemen. Three minutes and two seconds. We already got one piece. One gear done. Don't look at me. <laughs> Maggie's just staring at me because I got a treat up here for her. The good news is I can say that over and over again. She doesn't like whimper and beg and stuff. It's if I said another word, she'd be whimpering and begging, which I'm not going to say that because it's unfortunately a very horrible day outside, so that won't be happening. Okay, I'm going to try to fight these next guys with just the bomb poop move. I'm going to try to beat him with just the bomb poop move. That there. I did. Now, if you shut up, I can do it. How about that? Be bomb poop move. Bomb poop move. Bomb poop move. Let's go. It's Cluck! No? Yes? No? Put your head down, boo. You'll get it after. Head down. She's just on edge now, waiting for me to give her that give her that treat. But you'll get it in a little. You'll get it in like tenish minutes. You gotta wait. She's a very patient dog. I gotta give her that. All I know is I'm gonna poop bomb that. Spell punk. Oh my god, I do rapid! Here we go! I didn't know I could do a rapid. I thought I had to do one and then wait a second or two. Then I can just do rapid. Oh, I got the spell punk done. Oh, well, how the heck did he get up there? Y'all see that? <laughs> the time golem dude was just floating on top of the actual thing. So this works great for knocking enemies up in the air. My god. Got him. I did it. <laughs> That took way longer than I needed it to. Oh, Call of Duty's installed, everybody. Now y'all know I play Call of Duty. New Call of Duty update, though. I don't know what that is. I haven't played Cold War in forever. I play um, the Zombies mode. And by play, it's, I haven't played it in like two or three months now. It's been a very long time. Oh, we're going to do the slam, wham, bam, thank you, slam move. So puff up. Oh, I puffed up by accident. We're going to just defeat the defeat these guys with just the slam move. Which seems to be a lot easier. 
Look at that. The slam move does a lot of damage. Just 69 damage right now because of the um, because of the in element increase. I like that. I like the fact that I can roll once and then hit him with the slam move and still hit him sometimes. Nice! It looked like I literally just body slammed him like Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Famous hit movie actor. Let's go. The time stoppage doing well so far. Oh, I'm... Come on! Dude, I totally landed on that. It was I was like grinding the top. That was actually really funny. <laughs> Bing bong. Ooh, a big one over there. We're gonna use that for sure. So they haven't used this pop move a lot, I just realized. Like this one? Does a lot of damage. Pachoo. My hand's starting to hurt. I have been playing literally this game the entire like for three hours straight. Which is funny because I can play other games for even longer. It's just like Pachoo. whatever. <laughs> whatever. I know. Come on. Way, then I'll go there, and then I'll come here and go way. Stop. Imagine if you stopped time in the actual tower time and the time actually stopped. That would be sick, bruh. Come on back now, you're here. There we go. There we go. Shing, 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 shing. There we go. Nailed it. I like how the timer doesn't stop for the, uh... Let's go. Oh yeah, speed run, baby. Get this pretty quick. Unfortunately, we are not gonna be able to beat this within the time frame of everything else. We're just gonna pop pop it now. That's all we're gonna do is we're gonna pop pocket, pop pocket, poly pop it. Clock your gong, clock your gong. It's like Timmy and Tommy from uh, Animal Crossing. Oh yeah, you can't hit him unless he, um, unless time stopped. You know what, now we're gonna just pop it, never mind. We're gonna pop it, twist it, pull it, bump it. Oh, didn't get him, that's fine. We can do it, we can do it again. We'll fix it in post, don't worry. Yeah, there we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, yeah, let's go, baby. Look at the, look at this move. I love these homing pins, they're great. We got it. I'm not sure if you run faster when you're not popped. I think it might be the same, but I prefer to be popped. Yeah, I know, he pops up there. I did it purposely. See, I know this game. I know your game, Skylanders. Easy. Look at that. That's your speedrun tactic right there, ladies and gentlemen. If you guys want to be able to beat this level faster, use that tip. And also don't use poop bombs. Right on. Right on. He even, even Popthorn agreed with himself. He's like, yeah, don't use my poop bombs. Yeah, he's even said, don't use my poop bombs. Let's go. All right, break time. My hand is actually hurting, which is strange, because, like, I normally can play games all day, but my hand doesn't hurt. Maybe something else. Strange. Have you noticed that time kind of feels funny lately? Like it just stops sometimes. Maybe it's just me. I did. I'm a, I'm playing a game right now on my phone at this very moment while I'm going to come back. Let's see, did I win something? Did I win something? Ah, 10 daily grand prize entries, that's fine. I'm playing Circle K's 31 days, it's like an advent calendar kind of thing. Which reminds me, I have to open my advent calendar. Maggie has two. She's just that special. She has two advent calendars. Working on it. Now we get our mini battle with uh, Captain Gluck. Next one's in the bum. Oh, my hand, man. We'll be fine. It's funny, y'all is probably sitting there being like, oh my god, does is he recording like a bunch of videos after this and his hand hurts? No, 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 no. I've recorded a bunch of videos. 
before this. Watch out when I'm jumping Skylander. You don't know what you're doing. I think I, if I'm not mistaken, I can just freeze time and hit you, but I don't bother with doing that. That was Drill X! You remember that? There we go. Now I got him. Look at him! Look at his face! Look at his face! Hit you forward and back with a robo attack. And that's what he says. Drill X does. Remember Drill X? Y'all remember Drill X? Cringe. I don't care, I'm just hitting him. <laughs> oh, come on! There you go. I hit R2 like six times, and not even joking. I rapidly clicked that thing. Oh, no oh, crud. Okay, I can't answer that. Sorry. <laughs> My girlfriend's currently calling me, but I can't answer that because I'm filming the on half hour. My tower is impenetrable. <laughs> she knows not to call when I'm filming because I can't answer it. <laughs> All right. It's, good it's warm in here. Oh, Framage. Hey, Frames. Where'd you go? Hello. Ah. Oh. Woo! I don't know why. I just pro hopefully it's nothing recording on my end that's making like that. It might be too warm. My computer's kind of been on all day doing this, so. Here we go. Blam. Blam. Here we go. Okay, let's grab this. Wa waffles. Waffles and milk. Oh, this is going to end like super soon, I just realized. Because, like, let's see. What do I got for time? One minute. One minute left. Oh, I, I think I screwed that up. No, we're good? Oh, no! Now I screwed it up. Now I screwed it up. Dang it! <laughs> Alright, I think that's it. Nah, no, we're gonna quit out. I don't think I can do it. There's no way I can do that in time. There's no point. You hold your record this time, young man. But we're going to cut to just my face there now because the timer is going to end in less than one minute. So there's no point to keep it on. So yeah, we're going to give that. We're going to end it here now. Just give me two seconds to turn that off. We're, we're not going to let him talk. How about that? We're going to cut just my face. So all you guys out there know Pop Thorn. You know what he's like when he comes to him, how he plays, how he controls, if you used him, what level he came with, everything like that. Y'all get the hang of that one. You've all known that from the beginning. The biggest thing, though, is his moveset overall because it does technically take a little while to get used to because he does have a pretty unique moveset. So let's just run through each thing basically individually. The biggest thing is that he can puff up and puff down. When he's puffed up, he has those homing missiles. You can do that jump smackdown move, which does a lot more damage. And you can do the little rolling start where you can kind of get two hits on him, which is pretty good. But I don't see me using that one as much as the homing missile. So keep that in mind. So then when you're little, you have your main, um, what's it called? The main blow air move which is pretty good. You can get, you can basically hold down a circle and you just rapidly shoot air from your mouth, which is really cool. Um, his secondary move where you drop the butt bombs. All right, I guess. And um, that's kind of the big thing about him is he can puff up and he can puff down kind of thing. And that's basically it. Because when you're puffed up or puffed down, you're kind of only really using one move. I don't see me using that butt bomb a lot, even though I found that you can rapidly spam it. But the only time I'd use that is to knock an enemy up in the air so I can kind of, switch to my my homing move in a way i wish they did the puffed up where you actually drop the butt bomb and when you're in the little form you pounce forward so if they kind of switch them back and forth i think they'd be a lot more viable if i was the little one where i had to pounce because i'm not big i have to pounce and do what i can so i wish they switched those around so overall i think pop thorn deserves a four out of five because his moveset is very fun it's very much it's something that i very much enjoy the biggest thing is that they should have switched those moves around even though they are great moves i don't see me using them much as the main moves unless they were switched around so if you were a big pop thorn i would drop butt bombs every day because i drop a butt bomb they throw in the air i homing missile them they're dead it'd be sick kind of like wind up where you throw the um spring and they jump in the air and you can punch them while they're in the air i think that'd be awesome for pop thorn 
But yeah, I hope you guys agree with me. If you don't, let me know in the comments below what your opinion of Pop Thorn is, what you would rate him out of five, and who you're excited for in a future episode of this series. I will see y'all next week for another awesome episode. Y'all mean the world to me. Don't ever forget it. But as always, I bid you farewell.